morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are, whatever you're doing. How y'all doing? It's Kaiser. And getting back into some more Doctor Who news. So things have kind of continued to go downhill for the 15th Doctor, Doctor Who franchise in general, as ratings continue to plummet. Oh no, this was last week's article right here. Uh, this is this week's article. Doctor Who ratings continue to plummet. Latest episode posts worst overnight numbers in franchise history. Let's get to it here. So going over to that park place, Doctor Who actor Nishuti Gatwa blames racism for viewers abandoning show. Quote, it's really just sad for them, unquote. Yeah, uh, sure, buddy, whatever. In an article published by NPR on May 10th, the day before Series 14 released, the first two episodes of Space Babies and the Devil's Court, the shooting got to have blamed racism for why people were abandoning the show. He told the outlet, quote, I don't want to diminish racial aggression at all, but for me personally, I find it fascinating that it matters so much to these people. You're going to limit yourselves from a show that you claim to love because you don't like something or someone's appearance or their race, unquote. Gatwa added, quote, it's really just sad for them, unquote. Yeah, uh, sure, buddy. Gatwa addressed Doctor Who fans who might not be happy for his casting, saying, quote, don't watch, turn off the TV, go and touch grass, please, for God's sake, yes. Again, remember, last week we talked about this, that he literally told people, go touch grass, we don't want you here, basically. Yeah. <laughs> Again, look at the date on this article. This is actually today that this came out. So this is continuing on. All of these comments came in the wake of Gatwa's debut episode having the second worst ratings for any premiere of The Doctor. The Church on Ruby Road, which debuted on Christmas Day, only saw viewership hit 4.7 million in overnight numbers. That is far worse than Jodie Whittaker's debut episode, The Woman Who Fell to Earth, which only had a viewership of 10.96 million. Yeah. As reported by the Doctor Who TV, Space Babies only had overnight viewership of 2.6 million viewers. The Devil's Chord only clocked in at 2.4 million viewers. And the third episode, Boom, only brought in 2.04 million viewers. Um, let's see, 2.6, 2.4, 2.04. Uh, it methinks that you might have a diminishing viewership here and people that are just not tuning into your stuff. Consolidated figures have been released for Space Babies and the Devil's Cord. Space Babies only brought in a total of 4.01 million viewers across all screens in the week since the episode debuted. The Devil's Cord has only brought in 3.91 million viewers in the week across all formats since release. So day one numbers for those two episodes, 2.6 million and 2.4 million. And then over the course of a week, they've only been able to pull in 4.01 and 3.91 million views. So, I mean, that is really, really bad. I mean, really, really bad. And, yeah, it seems that that is only going to be the continuation for Doctor Who going forward because I'm pretty sure that this is going to be exactly what we're looking at. And it's not just here that things are continuing to play out, but apparently over on is like over here on the uh over here on Twitter X whatever you want to call it, Master of TDS is actually tracking like all the bot accounts that are apparently continuing to try and pump up numbers and pump up hype for the show and make it look like it's absolutely doing way better than it is. But again, you keep seeing the pattern that all of these, they're just continued. They're just continuing even more and more bots that are just continually pumping out more of this stuff again. Yeah. 
Jinx Monsoon is bre breaking boundaries and making history with her role in Doctor Who. And like, yeah, breaking barriers, breaking boundaries, breaking barriers. Bre okay, yeah. Do you notice a pattern with all of these ca accounts? Mm, I do. Again, this is exactly what we told you was going to happen. They're going to really get noticed for doing the absolute crap that they're doing. And then they're going to just continue trying to use bots to try and inflate their numbers. And it's only going to get worse from here. I'll be completely honest with you. You're, I, I can guarantee you now you're going to see a steady decline in the viewership of every single episode that releases for this current Doctor Who season. And I'm going to be right here along with y'all for the step for the entire season going along and sharing the news as it comes out. And definitely in the meantime, thank you all so much for watching. Go down there, hit that like button. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button and I will see you on the video next video. Peace. <laughs>